today we are going to read the story about the tiger and the mosquito from your book Mary Gold in CERT class 1 let's read the story about the tiger and the mosquito the tiger and the mosquito a tiger was dozing under a tree a mosquito came buzzing by buzz buzz the tiger said hey mosquito go away the mosquito said why should i go away i'm not afraid of you the tiger was angry he hit out with his paw see the tiger was sleeping under a tree he was dozing under a tree and a mosquito came buzzing by tiger sleep got disturbed and he said hey mosquito go away but the mosquito said why should i go away i'm not afraid of you and the tiger was angry so he hit out with his paw what do you think the mosquito is going to be smashed by the tiger's paw the mosquito flew off the paw struck his own cheek the blow scraped his cheek it began to bleed oh poor tiger he was angry he hit out with his paw but the mosquito flew away see the mosquito flew away the paw struck his own cheek the blow scraped his cheek and it began to bleed he must be in pain let's see what happened after that the mosquito buzzed away the tiger struck with his other paw Oh so the tiger did not the tiger did not lose hope he struck out with his other paw let's see if he was successful or not this time too he hit himself oh poor tiger the tiger was helpless the mosquito continued to buzz the tiger got up and quietly walked away see after getting tired by the mosquitoes buzzing he went away he quietly walked away the mosquito called out after him don't be so proud my friend everyone is great in his own way with this the story of the the tiger and the mosquito comes to an end and this story is written by mrinalini shrivastava Now let's arrange the story in the correct order. So what happened first in the story? There are four pictures. In the first picture, uh I can see a mosquito and a tiger getting angry on him. In the second picture, there is a tiger who is sleeping, who is sleeping under a tree. In the third picture, uh we can see a tiger going qua going quietly oh and in the fourth picture the tiger is hitting his hitting himself with his paw okay so what happened in the beginning of the story was the tiger hitting himself with his paw in the beginning of the story well no in the beginning the tiger was dozing under a tree so this is our first event of the story What happened after that who came in the story after that well yes a mosquito came buzzing by and he disturbed tiger's sleep see the here the mosquito is disturbing the tiger and tiger is getting angry on him because the mosquito is not letting the tiger sleep what happened after that well the tiger was really angry what did tiger do after getting angry the tiger hit out with his paw but the mosquito buzzed away and tiger hit himself see in this picture the tiger is hitting out with his paw but the little mosquito buzzed away and the tiger hit himself with his paw what happened after that in the end well the tiger got the tiger got tired by hitting out with his paw but mosquito used to buzz away every time and he used to hit himself 
So he was tired with this. He got up quietly and went away. Because he couldn't win against a mosquito. So this is the last event of the story. Can you imagine a big scary tiger couldn't hit a mosquito who was disturbing him? Well, I hope you enjoyed the story and you enjoyed arranging the story in its correct order. Do share this with your friends and ask them to arrange the story in its correct order. Bye-bye.